racing. Sadie.com with speed. Judith Ann finds the lead. Mama's rocker and flimsy also good to go. Dance rhythm is wide around the turn. Classic Nick's is second last and Washita Countess is the trailer. Six and a half furlongs to negotiate. Mama's rocker a half. In second, Judith Ann a length and a half. Flimsy in third, a half. To the inside of Sadie.com a length and a half. Then it's dance rhythm a half. Classic Nick's second last four and a half trailer. Washita Countess. Eight lengths from front to back and at three to one. Mama's rocker unseen since January in New Orleans on the lead Judith Ann Badgers to the outside Sadie.com makes it a line of three as the pace slows down dance rhythm goes up to fourth relegating flimsy to fifth after that we have classic Knicks and the trailer still is Washita uh, Countess it's halftime and we have a three-headed pace battle three abreast mama's rocker the inside Judith Ann in the sandwich with Sadie.com on the outside and Sadie.com is beginning to cut as they go past the three Sadie.com and Judith Ann dispose of Mama's Rocker. After that, we have Flimsy and Dance Rhythms beginning to swoop into action on the outside. Nothing from Washita Countess. Around about the quarter pole, R.D. Williams very confident on Sadie.com. Now he asks the daughter of Twilight Agenda to run, and she responds beautifully. Sadie.com puts a length on Judith Ann. Dance Rhythm left in the wake of a keen turn of speed by Sadie.com, and she's going to run up the score. Sadie.com and the Bulldog, R.D. Williams, turn this bad boy into a blowout. They stop the clock in 39 and 2. Nice. Dance rhythm second. Judith Ann a distant third. Sadie.com, R.D. Williams. Well, I'll tell you what, he can uh, he can flat out ride. He used to, uh, he rode for Wade White down at Oakland on some gambling horses, boy. I'll tell you what. Sadie.com, all one word. The winner, the seven horse. Dance rhythm, 12 and 480. Run second. Judith Ann third with Nolan. The Exacta returns just under $50. The Trifactor returns just under $300. And the pick three, 675, returns 85. 40 time of the race, 139 and two. From the top down, let's take a look at him, Sadie.com. The winner has the favorite at seven to five. Fifth event of the afternoon. Six furlongs here. Claimers at the $5,000 level. Four and up. We've got a field of 10, and the favorite is in the nine hole. Hefner Road, Robert Williams. Yes, indeed. Seven to two on the morning line. Go at five to two. Hefner Road, the favorite. R.D. Williams, here they are. And the race aim. Bad beginning for Gold Landing, who dropped back to last. Great beginning for Hefner Road, and Hef is on top. Ah, we have a jockey down. John Jacinto is off number four, Sidney Stephen. Jockey John Jacinto dumped out of the starting gate. Good news is, though, he bounces up. He bounces up and is walking okay by the starting gate. Sidney Stephen eliminated from the race. The others go on. Fight for the Roses to the outside of Hefner Road. The loose horses to the inside of the leaders and forcing them to go lickety split. Storybook Road, green colors, about three lengths from the lead, four and a half clear from hair raising. After that, we have Barry Bid to the inside of Simply Wahoo. Eccentric Tycoon is third last and the trailing two. Uh, we have at the back, River Girls Boy, the favorite is second last in Gold Landing Trails. At the top of the lane, Hefner Road runs away from Fight for the Roses and runs away from the loose horse who is running gamely. After that, we have Hair Raising to the outside of Gold Landing. River Girls Boy is beginning to fly on, but way too late, and Hefner Road is going to score. Hefner Road, the 5-2 to two favorite as they leave the gate, wins. In second, Fight for the Roses, Gold Landing will finish third. Do hold all tickets as the stewards will review the start of race number five. Always an inquiry when a jockey goes down out of the gate. Hefner Road, Robert Williams in the winner's circle. We want to tell you that John Haciento uh, survived the, uh, the gate incident and uh, will return to racing here uh, very shortly at Canterbury Park. Hefner Road, the winner, 780 on the front end. Fight for the Roses, another Tampa Bay shipper from the outside to 10 hole. Return seven and 440. Gold Landing with right runs third. The exacta just under $50. The trifecta, 9101, $340.20. Time for the race, 111 and 1. The picket fence, incredible. 72 in the morning line. Goes at 5 to 2 and scores here. Hefner Road with R.D. Williams. We'll take a break. We'll be right back. You're watching the Canterbury Report on 45. <laughs> 